Okay. To understand what's happening here, we need to know about Crypt of the Necrodancer, a video game where you delve down a dungeon moving to the beat. Every level has its own music that a shopkeeper of impressive vocal chops cannot help but sing along to. Understandably. Now, that's a synthetic voice, specifically the Omnisphere classical tenor A, ah, masterfully arranged by composer Danny Baranowski. I was unable to find any real voice cover of these vocals, so I tried my hand, starting like this. <laughs> I then proceeded through the soundtrack. Which was occasionally painful. And often humbling, whether due to high notes, or because breathing is hard. <laughs> but I persevered. Eventually, I was added to the game as an alternative shopkeeper, which you can hear the developers reminisce yeah, about the at boots. the five-year anniversary. The boots right, confuse me sometimes. That's so good. We made a thing that possessed <laughs> some person to do that. How's that for making a positive impact on the world? Am I not the cutest? And then... There was a sequel crossover with The Legend of Zelda, which means I now get to belt out classic Zelda tunes. what's happening.